Hi there, Jan Kuratkas here with Giga TV, and am at uh, Predict Gaze today and have two of the founders here. Why don't you guys introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about what you're doing. Hi, I'm Ketan Banjara uh, and this is Saurav Kumar. Uh, we make a vision control platform uh, that uses face recognition, gaze tracking uh, and gesture detection to uh, control devices and, and create consumer uh, analytics. All right, and I understand you guys can show us some of that stuff today. Uh, what are you, what are we going to see today? So I think one of the uh, demo that we're going to show uh, show to you guys is uh, using simple our uh, application to control the TV in a very natural way. So like if you're watching a video show or anything on the TV and you suddenly have to walk away from the room to maybe get some water or beer or go to washroom, the show automatically pauses itself and this works across different lighting conditions. It's, it's kind of natural that you don't have to pick the remote up and you have to pause the button to pause the show and you go out and you come back and then you unpause the whole thing again. So it's very natural in terms of that it detects those natural activity, automatically pauses it, automatically resumes. Yeah, natural TV control. All right, okay, let's take a look. So we have you two guys now watching TV. I'm gonna show the TV really quick. Here's the picture. It's coming from iPad, so it's a little smaller. It says user count too. Now I go back to you and walk away. Still playing. Okay. Because you're still then watching. If I also kind of walk away, then it pauses. And like if I come back. Then it should be like not working. Alright. And I can let's I'm gonna show to the TV and you can do the same thing one more time, just walk away. Then I have a one there. And it pauses. And if you come back. It starts playing again. Very nice. So the second demo is facial uh, recognition inside the browser so the idea basic idea behind this one was that uh, you're sharing your personal devices like laptop and iPads with your friends and family and a lot many times you have your personal information like logged in in your browser for example your Gmail is on Facebook is on and you forget to log out and then when your friends or family even though they don't want to see it and sometimes they want to check their accounts they see your information so what we did was like we take our uh, face recognition technology and we embedded it within the browser so for example right now Akash Chen is uh, looking at his Facebook profile so the camera recognizes that it's Akash Chen and he's looking at it and, and now for his just imagine that I happen to be like his friend which I am mm -hmm. and then I'm like you know so I come in front of him like looking at it and it says no you're not Akash Chen so it blurs the screen and maybe we can get it more transparent like you know more dark so that it doesn't see me and so I think it was, uh, and then I can log in as Sarah Kumar. And then just loads me in, and then. Obviously if like Akash comes in when he was logged in, so it's good, right? So now if Akash kind of comes in, it will, and I go out of the scene. So it blurs, the blurs it again, and he can't access your feed, but he could log in as Akash. into his account. So, All right. Uh, if yeah. I like kind of come back, which was the earlier case, so this thing will kind of go away because you know it recognizes this, it's me. So it took that thing away. All right. Thank you very much.